Hey, welcome back. Happy that you can join me. Uh, we're just moving on to, I think, finishing up the first lawn waves, I think? I didn't voice crack right there, if that's what you're thinking. All right, I'm not making the same mistake as I did before, so... Oh, but then I can't have the cherry bomb. That's not much of a loss, is it? But it's fun using the cherry bomb, so... Probably not gonna need the walnuts. The walnuts aren't really that important. I can live without them. They don't seem that bad. Plus, I pretty much make a good economy with the sunflowers anyway, so... That's why I have the ice peas. And the repeaters are, are the icing on the cake. So I feel pretty confident about myself. The, uh, this, this looks like a good layout. I don't see what could possibly go wrong with this, but... Of course, me being me, there's always a possible way of this going wrong. And I tend to make the dumbest mistakes, but... I consider myself a PvZ expert after giving you guys PvZ content for about, I would say, five years. I started this channel about 2015, but I didn't get so hardcore into PvZ until, I would say, January 2016. I was really hyped for Garden Warfare 2's beta, so much so that I just made a Garden Warfare 1 video for fun. I think that one was called Chompers OP. I'll put a link in the description. It's one of the first, like, Plants vs. Zombies videos I've ever made. I said one of. I think the official first Plants vs. Zombies video I've made was, uh... I think just playing the beta with Ben, and my mic was pretty shitty there, so, uh... I don't recommend you check out that video. I would check- I would recommend you check out Chomper's OP if you want to see some, uh... Some pretty, uh, intelligent, uh, video editing by yours truly. I wouldn't recommend you checking out my older stuff because my older stuff doesn't seem to be that good. Five years later, I've tend to do a lot better in editing and hence why I am now at 21,000 subscribers at the time of this upload. So <laughs> I think I'm pretty much good to say the least. But 21,000, that's a long way to go after five years. Can't believe it. But you guys mean a lot. Thank you guys so much. And I love doing this Plants vs. Zombies stuff. But of course I love doing horror stuff too. So I tend to make... I try I try to tend to make this channel like a little bit of a mix. If you guys know what I mean. But enough talking about me. Let's talk about these zombies right here. I think the Ice Peas are a really good choice. Because they tend to slow the zombies down. And I think that's really good. I think... When I do reach level 10, is that like a boss wave or something? Could be. I'll just eat you just to save me some more time. Alright. Uh, oh, right. Okay. Put that row with ice peas, and then I can start... I can start planting the repeaters. That way I can just speed things up. I could just use... Um, no, I think this will work fine, but... I tend to like to speed things up. I, I can just spend the rest of my sun on repeaters and chompers. And then, if it. Just for fun, if I do have enough sun, I can just start planting mines for no reason. Like so. I'll just plant one right there. That'll probably be useful at some point, but I don't know what yet, but hopefully it will. I could be totally wrong about that. <laughs> I just hope so. Whenever I hope to do something, it's not usually me succeeding in it, so... I take that definition with a, with a pinch of salt. Anyway, uh, yeah, they can't really get past this. Like, they're shooting three peas at a time with one of them just slowing them down. I think I'm at, I'm doing a good job with the sun economy. And just, uh... I can just plant more repeaters and plant more chompers. Looks like this chomper could use a friend. We're gonna make this little chomper have a happy little friend here. <laughs> no, I'm nothing like Bob Ross. I am not as calm as Bob Ross. Absolutely not. <laughs> we are absolutely nothing alike, despite me really wanting to be like Bob Ross. I can't really paint, but I can do a bunch of cartoon work. That's about it. That's the only experience I have in art, despite me being in a drawing class this semester. It's a real shame, but it is what it is. Alright, more chompers? Sure, why not? I can never have too many of them. This is just gonna completely guard it. Yeah, I think... Yeah, I'm pretty secure about this. Pretty confident. I have a row of chompers right here, so... I mean... I think just keeping the same row of all, like, the same type of pea plants 
keeps my OCD pretty good. I mean, if they put, if I put them in direct, different lanes, I'm just like, this is not right. I have like the strongest urge to dig them up at the same time I don't want to, because that way it makes my lawn defense less safer. But <laughs> it still doesn't look right. It's that's the thing. Like it's not right. I want it to be looking right. Wanted to have the same row with the same amount of plantaroos. You know what I mean? Just... It's that sort of thing. You guys have had that before, right? I know a lot of people that do have OCD. I could probably say I do because I am considered a germaphobe. And of course, I took the whole, like, flu season very seriously. And... And people were laughing me about it, but of course... We are through a pandemic right now, so who's laughing now, guys? They made fun of me for being a germaphobe, but uh, I showed them straight. Didn't I not? I guess so. It looks like I'm pretty much set for the final wave. I can just start messing around with the cherry bombs. Or maybe I don't need to? Maybe? I don't think so. I think I did alright. But I can just for laughs. Actually, no. Use it here. I can get more zombies in the process there. Alright, you're taking too long. <laughs> oh, okay. We got our first note. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. Hello. We are about to launch an all-out attack on your house. Sincerely, the zombies. Thank you for notifying me about that. It's not like you did that, like, the past nine levels, but... That's okay, I think that means this is a boss battle now. Yeah, I don't think I get a chance to plant anything as of now, right? I'm, it's on a conveyor belt. And we have the ultimate battle song, so that's awesome. Probably one of the best soundtracks in the game. I, I guess I can just pretty much plant wherever I want. Uh, I'll just plant you there. Just stall some time. I'm gonna save the cherry bombs. They could probably do me some good. Uh, I'll plant you there. And uh, I'll save the cherries. Definitely save the cherries. Gonna keep my conservation pretty good. Not gonna spend them on anything dumb. But uh, we're gonna be smart about this. So, he's gonna die from that. I guess I should put the chomper here, maybe? Uh, sure, why not? I don't have any, I don't really know. I'm just uh, just improvising this. I feel like I should do something smart, but apparently I'm just sitting here just playing Plants vs. Zombies at 3.30 in the morning. What else could could be different about my life? Pretty much nothing. I would pretty much do this anyway, even though... Even if I did have school. <laughs> uh, but, uh, of course, I do tend to bend a lot of rules of society. But doesn't anybody do that? A lot of teens did that back in the day, but me being 21, I'm still very immature, and I tend to still bend rules a lot. But hey, that's where I've gotten to right now. No, don't eat my chomper, you dickhead. Don't do that. I'm just gonna... Oh, I can just start a whole fort right here, so that's pretty good. Right, I'll just enhance the body. No, he's gonna eat my mine. Oh, for God's sakes. Okay, rip mine. That didn't go well. Uh, what needs the most def- okay, okay, I'll put a repeater right there. Uh, okay, just completely ignore that. Uh, okay. I shouldn't really put that there. Instead, I should probably put... Oh, you know what would help here? Ice pea. That would definitely help. I feel like that side's getting like attacked the most, so... I think it's pretty good that I do something like that. Yep, that's why. I, that's also another reason why I placed the mines there, because the pole vaulters will just jump right over it, and then they just go for the walnut, and they still can't get past it. Because they're too dumb, because they only use their walnut, their... No, the vault ones! Why can't I speak? Alright, put that there, slow you down. Uh, put another repeater there for why not. Put that there. I still have a lot of, um... Still have a lot of those, so... In case an emergency happens, I'll just place another thing there. Uh, let's see. 
Anything I can really use on? Uh, nothing. Okay. Interesting. Uh, looks like he's gonna eat that spadow. Unless I do this. Okay. Looks like my stuff is safe. As of now, but I'm not gonna get too cocky about this. Now I can. I have, like, I have, like, three repeaters in that one row. Okay. Uh, actually, you know what? I can just do this. I can just get rid of the, the weaker peas and just replace them with the stronger ones. Oh, but then that's... No, because that would make more sense. Okay, well. I have a bunch of these, so I can just use them. Fight for your country, I guess. Okay, uh... Where should I... Okay, put that there. Uh, put this here. I'll just put a walnut right there. <laughs> I'll just place them at the at the exact front so they can just get stopped no matter what. <laughs> that's, uh, that's pretty entertaining. Alright, place that there. I just have rows of these things. <laughs> it's insane. I don't really care if they die. I'm sorry, pea shooters, but you don't matter much to me since I'm upgrading you to, like, stronger ones. Alright. Uh, no, wait, wait, wait. Which one doesn't... Oh, they all have ice peas. Okay, if that's the case, put that there. Alright, so I'm saving up five, like, uh, <laughs> cherry bombs. I could probably just spam them at the final wave. I think I can serve long enough. I think it's about time. I think they just ate that walnut. I'm running out of rows to plant pea shooters and stuff. I've just ran out. <laughs> what do I do about this? Oh well. I guess that's potato mine's gonna get him. And I can just I used up all the rows! <laughs> what well, now what? <laughs> They can't really do much. I have them completely filled. <laughs> okay. Uh, if you're gonna finish off that. There you go. Time to spam these. There we go. That was completely necessary, by the way. <laughs> Wonderful job. Okay. What about... Oh, it's the night scenes. Okay. Evening, explore Apple. Those zombies just won't let up, will they? You'll notice that fighting zombies at night is different than in the day. For one, you won't get any sun falling from the sky. You can still get sun from sunflowers, though. And lucky for you, you got yourself some puff shrooms. Plant as many of those as you can, and you'll be A-O good. Alright, I'll take Crazy Dave's word for it. Okay, looks like there's gonna be some brown coats, and... What was those? What are those things? They're, uh... Newspaper zombies, that's what they were. Um... Take you, you. Actually, I probably don't need you. I have the puffers. So, I don't need those. Probably don't need those either. What do, What should I get? Yeah, probably to speed things up. Sorry, Chomper. I was really tempted, but I don't think I really truly need it. Uh, they're gonna come out of those graves, aren't they? That's gonna be annoying. But, whatever. We'll just work with it. So, I guess the process of trying to get sun is going to be a lot slower. Hence why I have these puffers. So, this will be fine. And, uh, I could just start a row right here. And I guess if this flower eventually wants to give me more sun, I can make another flower and just speed up my process of my sun economy. Eventually, if you want to give me more sun today, please, thank you. Take a million years to give me just a one patch of sun. <laughs> what are you guys doing? I didn't just plant you there for nothing, just work, damn it. <laughs> Lazy bums. Oh, now I get money. Why couldn't I get money before? That's cheap. No pun intended. But I just, I want to like spend my money on stuff. Just get newer stuff ASAP. I don't want to wait to get money. Who wants to wait to get money? Nobody. So why should I in this game? Makes no sense. Okay. Enough ranting. I'm speeding up my process with the flower economy, so we should be okay. Hurry up. You know what it is, though? I think I might replace the sunflowers with the sun shrooms. They don't do much, but they eventually do grow to size, and they do save me a lot more sun, and they just produce sun like normal sunflowers so the mushrooms do do a really good job at um 
protecting. So I don't see anything wrong with that. Oh, I unlocked the co-op challenge versus mode. Well, I'm probably not going to need that, considering that I can already do versus mode on my Xbox One. I had to replay this on my 360, because this game will not allow me to play, to restart my complete data on Xbox One. So I might as well just keep the saved data I already have on my Xbox One, perhaps, and just keep, and just play the story mode all over again on 360 and just slowly unlock everything from there. I mean, that would make the most sense. I don't see why I shouldn't do that, but... No, wait, no, I didn't mean to plant you there. I wanted the flower. I just wasted that. I don't think that matters much, but... Yeah, the, no, it doesn't, because puffers don't even cost any sun. So that wasn't even a loss. Okay. Let's see what you can... Oh, get away! Oh, he has a shield up. Oh, that's a... No, okay, he was frozen there. Okay, I got lucky, but I should be more careful about that. Okay. I guess I can't really plant a walnut there because there's a grave there. I can't wait to get the grave digger and just get rid of it. Those things are pains. I could do that, but I don't think there's really any need for it. I could plant more stuff. But ice peas are doing a good job as they are. Kudos to the ice peas. And then... Okay, the buck, the not bucket heads, the newspaper guys are probably going to be a bit of a pain. Unless I do- No, we walked past it! No! For the love of God. Okay, fine. You want to bend the rules, game? I can play your way. I'm, I bend PVZ all the time. This game is no different. I probably broke Battle for Neighborville at least like five times. <laughs> this game is nothing different. You got nothing on me, game. Absolutely nothing. It looks like I'm about, I'm about to reach the end too, so. Probably keeping this pretty secure. All right, placing that there. And then if I just probably get enough sun, I can just probably just blow them all up. Wait, do they come out of the tombstones? They do come out of the tombstones. Oh God. Hey, that's cheap. Cheap. That's what you get for cheating. Get blown the hell up. And then... Oh, I can't really use it again. Can I just speed up my process? Can I get another thing, please? Or can I get a repeater? Anything? Oh, uh, you know what? Actually, let me do this. <laughs> speed things up a little bit. The puffers don't really do anything until they're in range, so... Uh, not much we can really do about it, but that works either way. Okay, I, I unlocked the sun shroom, so perfect. I'm probably not going to need the sunflowers for this. I can probably just save some more time and plant more shrooms. You know what I mean, not the illegal ones. Hey, you've collected $290 in coins so far. Why do you care? When you collect $750, i will say you something really neato. Oh, so you're paying attention to my money, huh? Well, why don't you mind your own business, Dave? Seriously, that's a little invasive. I should really call the cops on you for that. That's probably illegal in like 49 states. But then yet again, why would the cops care if there's zombies trying to enter my house? They don't seem to be attacking any other neighborhood, so they probably don't care <laughs> if there are cops alive. I, I, there, I, there's no other people from my knowledge in Plants vs. Zombies except Crazy Dave, so who the, who knows? Who really knows? Eh, this looks like a good setup. Okay, let's continue forward. I'm gonna be using the mushrooms now. Hopefully by after this round, I would be able to collect enough to get... Maybe I'll unlock the grave digger. That'd be nice, that'd be pretty nice. So I think these little guys just give me 25 sun, no, 15 sun. If I, yeah, that's 15 sun each, but eventually they grow big and strong and they give me more sun. I think that's like the 25 sun. So it's um, just planning ahead using these little guys. They don't really show up again, which is kind of sad, but these guys are pretty worth it. That's why I'm going to plan on planting three of them. They're pretty good, especially since there's like more of them I can plant. I think this would work out pretty well in my favor. 
And then we have, yeah, it's like, can notice that my process of getting more sun is a lot more faster. Even though it's like small quantities of sun, it's still pretty effective. They're eventually going to grow up big, though. And they're going to give me more of those. So, it's a good deal. Making some good uh, sun. It's all about the sun, not the money. <laughs> Why should I care about money in a zombie outbreak? Should care more about sun. That's how we save ourselves from zombies. I mean, they've survived for about 11 years. Crazy Dave has some, uh, well, thinking. I guess at this point he's not considered crazy anymore if he's, like, one of the only people that survived against zombies. <laughs> I don't think I'm wrong about that. Okay. When do you guys start growing up big? Because I could really use your help as of now. Uh, okay. Coneheads are starting to show up. Uh, let me plant... Let me plant a nut right here. And then I guess eventually I can just get rid of the... Once I get enough sun, I can probably replace them with like the frozen peas and the, and the pea shooters. I can just still plant them outside, but it doesn't seem like I really do need it. I do have the cherry bombs though as an emergency, so that could work. Uh, okay, they are starting to grow up. Very nice. And let me just plant those right there. Sure, let's just add more support to it. Alright, look like they've got it. And I can just start... Uh, this bottom row could use some help. And then I could take care of that. Yeah, this will go by very well, I think. I don't see that there's any problem with this. No, wait. Let me replace that. No! I wait, I placed the wrong thing. I'm an idiot. Okay. I should not, I should pay more attention to this because I do that a lot. I don't make a lot of rational decisions. And that's my downfall. Like, I'm, I'm not that smart. <sighs> I don't do well with smart stuff. I do a lot of dumb stuff. I'm good at being dumb. <laughs> yep, that's pretty much my, pretty much my only purpose in life. Being dumb. But... Who really can be smart in this world? That's probably... That's probably, um... What are those? Oxymorons? They don't plan on being smart. I think, of course, they plan on trying to be smart. I'm just not thinking smart. You know what? I should not just keep talking. It's 3 a.m. <laughs> I'm gonna use that as my excuse. Let's just go with that. There we go. Th now the sunstreams are paying off. They're doing pretty good, giving me some good sun economy. Let me just replace that with that, because I'm just going to prepare for, for when that zombie pops out of that tombstone right there. That's going to be a bit annoying, but I can get around that. I'll place that there. And... I could pl keep the puff shrooms there, but if the repeaters are going to be like stronger, I don't see a reason to keep them. Unless it's to screw around like this. So, just take up every single row like I did before. That's kind of funny. So, yeah. So my sun streams are paying off. Getting some good sun out of it. And it looks like my sun economy looks to be back to normal, perhaps. It does indeed, so I can just... No, wait, did I just place two... Ugh. I didn't mean to do that, but... Alright. I can just replace that easily. Keep it with something stronger. I mean, this is a good setup as it is, but... I can just keep on adding more, because I can. They're, they're gonna keep on giving me more sun, so... I'm, I can just get rid of more of the, uh, of the puffers. And just replace them with the repeaters. I should've just done it with that tombstone right there. But then yet again, wouldn't they just... When the zombie that comes out of it just gets really strong and just eats the repeater. Well, you know what? I'm be willing to take that chance. They're gonna they're gonna he's gonna take down like five peas and being slowing down, so I think that's a pretty good gamble in my opinion. Okay, what's next? And then there's gonna be this. So very nice. And then. Oh, you know what? I can probably just fill this entire row up. Can't I? 
Yeah, looks like it. Looks like the final wave is about to commence. It would make me happier if I have uh, one more repeater. So the no, uh, whatever. Didn't mean to do that. I involuntarily did that. Okay, it didn't even matter. The wave's over. All right, let's see. Looks like I do have time for one more game, so I can do that. Pretty simple. I can do one more night level, and I can probably call it an episode. Looks like I'm already doing pretty well. It's not going to take me that long to edit. But you know what? I can use fume shrooms. Uh, let's see. Repeater, maybe. Uh... You know what, actually? I could probably put repeaters in the back. And maybe chompers. And of course... Could that work? Well, the fume shrooms are going to take care of the door guys regardless. So, I don't think I really need Chomper. It'd be cool to have them though, but under this circumstance, I think Walnut's going to be a little bit better to use. But there'll be a time where I'll use Chomper again, just for laughs. I think I eventually just unlock another slot. I have six now, but I think you can have up to eight. Don't quote me on that, but... That's from my experience and my collective memory of this game. I don't know if that's for, for real or not, but we'll find out for ourselves, I guess. All right, I guess, yeah, they're gonna come by really slow. Give me some more time to plant. Yeah, this is just a one flag uh, level, so after this I can probably call it an episode. Doesn't seem like it's gonna be that bad. Just keep giving me more of these, and we should be all right. And what's next? You coming up next? Okay, good. Very nice. No, wait, didn't mean to plant you there. I was planning on having a sun shroom there. Why do I keep making such dumb mistakes? I just misplant them everywhere. And I just, it's my fault. I'm the one who's planting them. And I just don't pay attention to, like, the upper bumper. But that's just a me thing. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I get it. You want my brains. You're not having them. Shut up. <laughs> you lose brain privileges. Eat your own brain if you have one. I don't know what I'm saying anymore, okay? Don't judge me. Okay, here we go. If I start making enough, I could probably put repeaters in the back, and I put I can put the fume shrooms in the front, since they're closer range. That could work just for- oh god! I didn't realize there was a cone head here. You just stall him while I continuously plant these. I'll put that there. <laughs> Why not? Okay. Looks like they're starting to grow pretty big. They're becoming big boys. Good job, big boys. Now protect my protect my stuff. Is that gonna kill in time? Give me a walnut, please. Walnut. Duff. Ah. Okay. He's, he's gonna eat that. All right. I'm definitely gonna need a fume shroom right here. And I can replace you with this. Looks like this could do well. Yeah, I can use some extra support. I don't think the peat shooter would do any good if the fume shroom's taking care of it. Yeah, I think that would do much better than it already could. So, was there a point to that? Probably not. But I want to make myself feel better and say it, it is. Okay. Replace you with this. I can just put that there, just for some extra protection. Not condoms. I know what you're all thinking. There we go. Uh, should I place... Yeah, I can place fume shrooms there because that can just take care of multiple zombies, I think. That could work. Place two rows of fume shrooms and then a row of just uh, some repeaters. That could probably work. Or maybe just have the entire row of fume shrooms. But then they don't do as much range, so... Would there really be a point to that? Probably not. 
Especially since this level is going to end soon. I feel like that just placing these uh, repeaters is just a waste of time. But I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, yeah, of course that's a cone head. Really nice. Yeah, you're a dick. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Doesn't matter. I saved that for the end. Alright, just hurry it up. There we go. Now I get the grave digger. I'm going to have a lot of fun with those. Take care of those annoying graves in the next episode. So I think that's all the time I'm going to have for this. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. If you guys are enjoying this, like, do let me know. I, I love doing these types of stuff. I'll see you all next time. Hey, want to buy an extra seed slot? It'll cost you $750, but you'll be able to choose seven seeds per level instead of six. Sure. All right. And hey, when you save up to $5,000, I'll sell you the eight seed slot upgrade. Check you later. All right.